mammalian heart to be in precise the internal structure. On the right side, we're going to discuss on the pulmonary artery, the vena cava, right auricle, and the right ventricle. On the left side, we're going to discuss on the outer pulmonary vein, left auricle, and the left ventricle. The blood flows from other body organs into the heart through the vena cava and into the right auricle. And from the right auricle, it flows to the right ventricle through a valve known as the tricuspid valve. This tricuspid valve is held by tendons. And the blood flows out of the heart to the lungs of the pulmonary artery. The blood then flows to, from the lungs into the heart back again through the pulmonary vein into the left auricle. And from the left auricle, it flows to the left ventricle through a valve known as bicuspid valve. The blood then flows out of the heart to the other body organs through, an, through the aorta. Now, the right ventricle and the left ventricle have muscles known as the cardiac muscles. The left ventricle has a thicker wall than the right ventricle because it has to generate a force that will push the blood out of the heart to the other body organs. But the right ventricle has a thinner wall because it only uh, generates a force that will make that will that is needed to for the blood to flow to the lungs. Okay, between the between the right side and the left side of the heart, there's a there's there there's there's a muscle known as the septum. This prevents the oxygenated blood from mixing with the oxygen.